Because how's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking the body beat down here on this Monday afternoon. So today we're going to be doing chest. Maybe just chest. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm, I'm ill prepared. I have no idea. I just know I'm doing chest. So uh, pretty good weekend guys. Didn't do a whole heck of a lot. Uh, took it easy. As usual. That's what you do on your weekends. You take it easy. You know, so that's what I do. So, uh, yeah, let's get to working out and get it done because I'm ready. Everyone, stick around. <laughs> I may never get a paused rep with 405, but I can touch and go. Phew! That was rough. <clears throat> Alright, we're going back down to 365. Two tens. Okay, so I went down to 355. We got two tens on the end. We got a 10 and a 5 on each end. Going 
down to 335. Now we just have 110 on each end. just like that we're done with another workout and yeah that's all I'm gonna do today is chest Whew. man that 405 felt pretty good it felt like one of my better ones that I've done speaking of better ones today marks the one I've done 405 pounds eight times now and I've done 410 pounds one time now. Uh, the first time I did 405 was 729.24. So not too shabby. Uh, I don't do, I don't try to go for my max every week. I'm not gonna do that because uh, that's a lot of weight and you shouldn't be going for your max every week. Especially on a bench, you're gonna get hurt. Deadlift, not a big deal. You're not really doing much there. But the squats, that might be, you know, the squats and the bench press, I think, are two you need to, you know, you need to do your, your work and then go for your, your maxes there. So uh, you need to put in time and effort with heavy sets of singles to two, three, four, or five reps maybe, all the way up to doing a little bit less weight and trying to get upwards of maybe 10 uh, 10 reps and on those crazy days maybe 20 reps so all this stuff works together and allows you to hit your max again it helps you to reach your max safely and it can help not can help but it does help to propel you just another step farther than your max another five pounds ten pounds so all this stuff works together and that's how you that's how you should probably train my humble opinion so uh, be careful whenever you try to go for your max lifts so often because things can go wrong believe me uh, so anyway a good workout as you've seen I got the 405 and then I worked my way down and uh, and when I'm when I'm working my way down like that that's where I can tell that I need a little bit more work uh, doing the more reps with a little bit like mid-range weights like I used to do I don't do it as much as I used to but I can tell that I struggle a little bit more and uh, I need to work on kind of those you know heaviest mid-range kind of weights like anywhere from maybe 315 to 355 and really do a lot of focus in there and get to where I can do more of the 5 to 10 rep range off in there and uh, and then that'll help propel your your lift further so anyway pretty good little workout today I'm very happy I got the 405 and uh, stick around because we'll probably get it again and uh, 
if I give you a little inspiration to work out, maybe go for a walk, clean up your nutrition side a little bit, or uh, maybe talk to somebody and uh, maybe get uh, some things off your chest, talk to a psychiatrist, and you know, the mental aspect of life. Kind of, if, if I give you some inspiration to do kind of some of these things, maybe like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Bite of Beat Down. That's me, Michael, your Care About You host. And don't forget, get up, get out, get red. Do it to it, and we'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. See y'all later. Get up, get out, get red, and do it to it.